Hi everyone, this is Danny for DoTech and welcome back with a brand new video. In this video, I have another 5 new tweaks to share it with you guys. With that being said, let's get started. Okay, so let's start the first CD tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the blank badge. And simply, I think the name just explains himself. So what is that tweak is going to be providing you with is going to be make your badges bouncing and it's going to be giving you the blank style for your badge so let me just show you guys right now how it's going to be it looks like if i want to go to my home screen as you guys can see most of the badges right now that i have after i install that tweak is going to be kind of like giving me a blank style so let's jump right now into the settings to show you guys what's going on there okay so under the settings as you guys can see we have four options so you can pick the option from here so as you guys can see i already choose the blank and then also you have other three options so you can pick the style that you want to set it on your iDevice for your badges and this is how it's going to be looks like when you download the tweak really beautiful and nice tweak to download it on your iDevice highly recommend you guys to give it a try blank badge all right, so let's jump right now into the settings tweet that I have for you guys in today's video, which is I'm going to be talking about the hero. So what is that week is going to be providing you with is going to be add most of the icons that you have on your control center or most of the icons that you have in your home screen on your status bar, as you guys can see. So right now, so first of all, let me just talking about the settings here as far as we are right now under the settings and the first thing I need to do to enable the tweak and then after that it's going to be giving you more than options so you can go through all the options here as you guys can see it's a lot of stuff make sure after you're done from all the settings to hit the respring so your device will be take the effect. Let me show you guys right now how I have most the things or how I have the access on most the toggles the icons that I have on my status bar so for example as I show you guys if I want to have an access on my time as you guys can see simply you can have an access on every single thing from your status bar as far as you have most of the icons there so this is how is the tweak is going to be allow you to have an access on every single icon that you have here for example the battery here even I can put it on the safe mode as you guys can see it has been changed and I can just turn it back on just like so this is how is the the uh, tweak is going to be allow me to have an, uh, the access on most of the things from my status bar it's nice and a beautiful tweak to set it on your i device as far as it's going to be giving you or providing you with all that access from your status bar make sure to give it a try here are. The next idea tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the bio locker. And what is that tweak is going to be providing you with is going to be uh, secure your application, notification, messages, calls, and every single thing that you have on your iDevice and secure that maybe your device will be stolen or you will be just uh, losing your device somewhere. So you will be protect most of the thing that you have in your iDevice with a bio locker. All right, if we jump right now into the settings to show you guys how is that going to be work. So once you launch your any kind of application after you set a passcode or you can use your fingerprint to run most the application on your iDevice. So this is how it's going to be the message after you set everything. You need to enter your passcode or you can use your fingerprint in order to make that work. So for me, I already uh, make a passcode here and this is the settings for that tweak. So the first thing when you run the tweak, you need to just enable the tweak. And then after that, you can go to the more than section. As you guys can see, we have the application, we have the flip switchers and we have the folders, we have the notifications and we have the settings. Each single one individual has the uh, setup and some settings. So if you want to go to the application, you can enable the application that you want to set for your or to protect that application using your fingerprint. And as I told you guys, you can set a passcode. A little quick, you guys right now have an idea. If you want to uh, set a passcode, let me just show you guys how is that going to be work. So you have to go to extras here in the bottom and as you guys can see here is the custom passcode so simply if you just tap on it you will be created uh, the passcode for every single 
application if someone want to open it is going to be asking you for that passcode that you've already set here in the bottom as you guys can see how is the way of the bio locker you want it to work on your i device so you have the dark and you have the light and then you have the extra light so you can set it the way you like and then this is how is the tweak is going to be providing you with really nice and a beautiful tweak to protect a lot of things on your i device highly recommend you guys to give it a try bio locker okay so the next cd tweak that i have for you guys which is going to be really excited about it which is going to be the atmos and what is that tweak is going to be providing you with once you download the tweak that tweak is going to be providing you using your home screen lock screen notification style which is going to be really amazing and beautiful if you want to set it on your i device let me jump right now into the settings to show you guys how is that going to be looks like okay so as you guys can see right now we are under the settings we have two options which is going to be the first one open lock screen settings and then the second one which is going to be open notification center settings so if i tap on the first one here it's going to be providing me with more than option as you guys can see here we have the style for the icons and it also is going to be giving you more than the style and then if you tap here it's going to be giving you the small medium large and full size of icon you can set that on your lock screen and then notification center as well and then here if you want to go through most of the options here you can set that as well i'm going to be showing you guys right now how is that going to be looks like when you set the tweak on your lock screen to show you guys right now a test i'm going to be top on it right now here and this is how it's going to be looks like so it's going to be providing you with the icon and then underneath the icon is going to be the message simply if you want to tap on icon you can hide the message if you want to read it you can simply just stop on it and read that icon okay so back right now to open notification center settings so if i top here on it so pretty much it's going to be giving me the same style of options you can customize that let me just show you guys right now how is that going to be looks like if i want to give it just face for that so this is how it's going to be the style for your notification center each one individual as you guys can see so you can top on it if you have message and then this is how it's going to be looks like really beautiful as i told you guys if you want to set that tweak on your i device the nice set the icons the notification how it's going to be looks like even in lock screen as i show you guys how it's going to be looks like beautiful and nice and i'm really excited about it i highly recommend you guys to give it a try atmos the next idea tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the edge alert. What is that tweak is going to be providing you with? It's going to be bringing the style of the alert for the Samsung S8 into your iDevice. Let me just like my screen right now and showing you guys how is that going to be looks like. So there you go. As you guys can see right now, the alert will be around the edges, and this is how it's going to be looks like when you set the tweak on your iDevice. All right, so under the settings, as you guys can see, the first thing that I need to do to enable the tweaking is going to be providing you with more than color here. So you can set the color that you want on your iDevice or for your alert. And in here, the sliders, as you guys can see, is going to be giving you an option. So you can set the options that you want for your alert. And that is pretty much it. It's really beautiful and nice. If you want to set it on your iDevice, highly recommend you guys to give it a try. Edge alert. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos and i see you guys in next video peace